Good day, everyone, and welcome to another edition of Japan Journal, another day in the life of Brother Mal in Japan, coming to you live from GNN, the Global News Network, a division of Total Communications Group Japan. And uh, we're coming to you on Japan Journal, the Internet's number one weekly English language online cybercast from Japan, with yours truly, Brother Mal, here bringing another episode to you. And today it's a little bit of a business conversation for you.、Uh, we want to announce the upcoming national release of the Paul Jackson original album, where he was the band leader and all of his songs that he wrote, composed, and recorded are featured on his debut project entitled Black Octopus, issued by Toshiba EMI back in. 1978. That's 44 years ago at the time of this recording. And、uh, I managed Paul, rest in peace,、uh, up until the time of his passing as his business manager and、uh, executive producer on some of his projects and、uh, securing contracts for his publishing and such things as that. And Paul often played at my club. He performed at Mallet's Bar. And so We had that relationship. He was my big brother. And before he passed away, he entrusted the master tapes with me of the Black Octopus Project and the subsequent four more bonus tracks that he entered into that project, reproduced it, remastered it some 20 years later.、Uh, so, Black Octopus 2, if you will, with bonus tracks. And、um, so, we have had all the masters for that. And then after his passing, two years ago, coming up on March 18th, 2023, will be the second anniversary of his passing. But on this Christmas, December 21st, 2022, Total Records, Japan's first and oldest black owned record company in Japan history, Total Records, will release and reissue. And distribute throughout Japan initially and then the world subsequently the Black Octopus Project. So, what's exciting about today in this broadcast is the fact that recently I, I do all the contracts, so I have a history of writing contracts for music people, you know, artists, representatives. And、uh, in our contracts, we always、uh, insist that I, as the licensed holder of the copyright, I have been contracted by、uh, Mrs. Jackson and the family estate of Paul Jackson's legacy material as his business manager to release and exploit that product on the Toe Town Records label. So I am the copyright owner for a period of years here, and then I am able to then subsequently do licensing agreements with distributors and Promoters, producers, and people who, who may want to reproduce and remix some tracks. That's all of my job as the president and executive producer of Toe Town Records. That's my job and responsibility on behalf of the Paul Jackson estate and his family. So I said all that to say, look forward to this is an announcement. As a matter of fact, we'll do a more uh, direct uh, uh, promotion on this and have done some things. But、uh, here's what I want to share with you today. I have been in the CD business in the entire career of、uh, Toe Town Records, established back in 1986. So, but for the first time, I am here to tell you, if you don't know already, that analog is back. Artists have been paid minuscule、uh, revenues on their copyright and their sales through the streaming business, and you have major artists today who are quitting、uh, Spotify and these other streaming, online streaming. Businesses who do not respect the artist's work, and、uh, it's just the business model. But analog businesses, what we do in our contracts, we license a distributor to reproduce our copywritten product, which, by the way, let me cut to the chase, is this. And this is mastered and pressed up on vinyl, 33 inch vinyl. Uh, 16 uh, centimeters, 12 inch, 20, 20 is how to get the size. But it's a vinyl, you know, vinyl records. And here, for the first time, I'm going to play with you or for you today 
This is a test press of Paul Jackson Black Octopus from our new distributor, Disc Union, in Tokyo. And this union is being entrusted and licensed to Dozo Koryo The master, initially we we're going to do 500 units for national distribution, but I'm telling you, for the first time, we're going to hear it together. And my job is with this test pressing to give it a listen and determine whether there are any mishaps in the original test press. And uh, so I'm going to do this on camera right here with you so you can listen with me. Now, what we have here in front of me is an Eon turntable with two little speakers in it. And because of the advent and the regrowth, the renaissance of the popularity of vinyl music, because it's fat, it's analog, and you need the right equipment. You need a good turntable and a good stylus needle and some great speakers and a system. But because of the young people in Japan and around the world who have not had an opportunity to hear the original recordings, now they are all buying turntables. We have a lot of DJs who will sample these tracks and do hip hop beats music. We'll be involved in all of that as well. But what's happened now with the industry, you can buy a turntable that has a USB connected to your computer so I can record the analog sound to my hard disk and to my mastering software. And it's got two little built-in speakers here, and I'm going to give it a test listen right now. Before you, you can listen to it with me. And if you hear anything, let me know, because we'll send it back, because it ain't correct. But I trust the master tape that I have remastered myself and sent to the people at this union. And our distributor has a, is outsourcing the manufacturing to another company. And I have a direct connection with that company, and this is how it's going to be. This is the A side, and this is the B side. Now, on this project, uh, the Paul Jackson Black Octopus full album from 1978 without the four bonus tracks, track number one. On the A side is Black Octopus Part One, titled Many Directions, 2 minutes and 46 seconds. So, this is the first time I'm using my brand new turntable, which is very cool. You know, uh, I suggest everybody go out and get one because analog is going to be back like Lazarus. So let me put it in here and test the sound. And it's going to be on a little small speaker, so let's see what we do. The power is connected, and here we go. Now I'm going to just, uh, to commemorate this playback, have a glass of wine here. How are we doing on time, Madam Producer? Okay, did you come down here? I just came back from seeing Wakanda, Black Panther, baby. Yeah. I don't mind telling you, I wept at the last scene, man. You gotta go see that movie. Incredible. So filled with history, symbolism, and all of that. And uh, enough of that. Let's put it to the test, baby. Press play. Okay, we're in trouble already. <laughs> Switch on. Okay, maybe we lost a little. Okay, Murphy's Law, baby. That's on video today. see what this says. Just now use this. Auto stop is off. Okay, there we go. We've got rotation, baby. So, ceremonially speaking, congratulations to my brother Paul Jackson. This is the test press of Black Octopus going on sale in the year 2022, December 21st. 
all over Japan and then subsequently in March from our distributor in Belgium. We'll be releasing this in the United States, Canada, China and the Asian countries as well as the Middle East and Europe. Here's the Black Octos, baby, on Toe Down Records. Check it out. Goodbye. Oh, uh, now let's see what these speakers are made of here. What it got in? I need my glasses. Here comes Black Octopus Part 1, Many Directions, track number 2. Black Octopus Part 2, Eight Ways of Love. Track number 3 on the A side, Funk Times 3. And track number 4, Burning in the Heat of Your Love. And that's on the B side, and then tiptoe through the ghetto. Four and five are on the B side, tiptoe through the ghetto. Track number five. Here we go. Let's see what we got. Let me turn this volume up. Let me hear a little humming already. And the lever here, we'll let the lever do the talking. Wow. Here we go. Paul doing spoken word initially.
One, two, three, funk times three. And that ends A, side A. Let's go to side B and see what we get for our money. That's beautiful, sounds great. Look at that test pressing. Boy, I think it's heavy too, because that's unfinished. You know, it's unpressed, but I'm real happy with that. Just give them a green light on that one, baby, for sure. Here comes a burning in the heat of your love and tiptoe through the ghetto. Give me another 13 minutes of your time as we want it. Perfect, perfect, excellent press mix. Wow, that calls for another glass. Track 
burning in the heat of your love. All tracks are on vocal. Next song after this is the one I like the best, Tiptoe Through the Ghetto. All tracks. Originally manufactured by Toshiba EMI Limited in 1978 in Tokyo at the Toshiba EMI Studios on Backdoor Music, Paul Jackson's original label, and published by Toshiba EMI Music Publishing Company Limited. The credits, acoustic bass, Paul Jackson on tracks A1, and then Mali Kameko and Yuka Kamebuchi, tracks A1 and B1, back vocalist. On bass clarinet, Benny Maupin, one of the headhunters. And on clarinet, of course, Herbie Hancock on tracks A1. And then Webster Lewis on tracks 2 on the clarinet. On track uh, side to B1. Electric guitar, Ray Oviedo. And then electric piano, Webster Lewis on tracks B1, in fact, B2 on this track. Engineered by Brian Bell. And assistant engineer, Bill Watts, Kenichi Yamaguchi, and Tameo Kawada. The cutting engineer, which the original wax press was, Mitsuhara Kobayashi, Shoji Taguchi, and Yoshio Okazaki. And then the organ, the hammer organ, Webster Lewis on tracks A1 and tracks A2. And the piano synthesizer and the art odyssey, of course, Herbie Hancock, the one and only. We have Webster Lewis on synthesizer, on the art string synthesizer on tracks B2. And the Yamaha C's 80 synthesizer by Webster Lewis on tracks B2. And of course, vocals, Paul Jackson, tracks A1, B1, and B2. All right, so there you got it. Coming at you once more, a reissue, baby, remastered accordingly. This is the, the test press of Brother Mal, the executive producer on the reissue project on Dope Records. I remastered this myself and we sent it to the manufacturer who did the test pressing and it came back just like I said it was. Fat, analog, and definitely deep in the groove. Check it out.
October 25th, 27th, and 1978. Also comes with a four-side booklet in English and Japanese, which shows photos, track lists, and the way and the diagrams of recording. The director disc technology will have all of that in the album that will go on sale on Total Records coming up on this December 21st, 2022. Don't miss it. Thank you very much for being with us, ladies and gentlemen, as we review this. I'm completely pleased and happy with this test pressing. I'm going to give them a green light. Break me off a thousand of these and we'll put them on sale on the 21st of December on Toad Town Records, Japan. Coming up soon in March on the, the commemoration of the passing, the transition of Paul Jackson on March 18th in 2023. We are scheduled to release it worldwide. But you can get it from me through the back door if you want it. I got you. Paul Jackson, rest in peace. Black Octopus. Wakanda forever. Peace, Brother Malin Jr.